Hello my fellow teabags. Cinemix77 coming at you today. Now, I've been asked a lot, what exactly is the edge of sin? Well, these are five of the best examples of a true blue edge of sin. Now, we'll start with this. The, uh, Technosharp ringed bully. As y'all can see, that is a mirrored edge. See my ceiling fan right there? And I will show both sides. Just extremely smooth, extremely sharp. And when I say smooth, these are mirrored edges on every single one of these. There's my ceiling fan again. Gotta love that. So, now what makes up the Age of Sin? It's quite easy. It's uh, a 20 degree bevel with a micro bevel. And the uh, overall uh, is 40 degrees conclusive so we'll go over that here in a moment see my ceiling fan again y'all gotta love that complete mirrored edges all of these are extremely hair wiggling sharp on these edges you gotta love that now there's my iPod my bald head so now gotta love that just gotta love it now, this is where we'll get into it. <clears throat> now, let's get these back just a sec. This would be your blade stock. This would be your bevel. And the darkened area would be your micro bevel and the apex of the edge. Um, this you know is a cutaway diagram so to speak center line 20 degrees either side on that so you know it's 40 degrees conclusive um, you know so you have a nice extremely you know nice angle of 20 degrees here 20 degrees here this is my favorite uh, edge because it lasts longer than most other angles that I've come across and it also uh, has the best edge retention because right here at your apex it's just beautiful um, you can get an extremely you know good high mirror polish you know out of this very easily so that's why I like it um, once again this right here is just your blade stock all right whether it be you know a chisel grind a hollow grind whatever that really does not truly matter when it comes to your cutting edge and that's what this is right here um, once again it's just center mass coming up just to show y'all that you know it's 20 degrees you know on this side 20 degrees on this side uh, this would be your micro bevel in here and your apex right there now how uh, I go about getting 
you know, you know, true blue, 40 degrees conclusive is, um, that, uh, is the degrees on my Lansky that I use. So it's a rough guesstimate, but, uh, I have to go with it since that is the angle degree that the system is telling me that I'm using. Um, and the, how I get my polished edges is from my strop. I do it by hand. Uh, I will tell y'all right now, this is not a stropping compound on here. It is a polishing compound. I'm not going to tell you, uh, you know, anything other than that. I'm not going to tell you the brand or anything, but that's how I get my edges to be, you know, mirrored. I polish them to be mirrored. Um, and, you know, it just makes sense to do it on my strop. I heat it up because it is uh, mainly heat activated. So I'll use either my Bic or my Zippo. All right and I will heat up the compound I will work uh, the angle that I sharpen the knife as I strop it and polish the edge and once I get done polishing the edge I actually run it over plain raw leather that you can condition and keep uh, clean with a little bit of mink oil or something along those lines a good leather lotion works as well it helps bring out all the metal that builds up and this colorization it helps clean and maintain and keep the leather nice and supple and fluffy too so but yeah that's how I get the edge of sin and when I say is the edge of sin and that's because y'all this thing is so sharp it is a sin you can ask exacto he has an edge of sin knife uh, it's not as refined as this I have actually refined my sharpening and honing skills to a T since becoming more involved in the YouTube scene and I'm ag actually rather enjoying that uh, <laughs> because I've never knew you can have edges like this ever and now I know that you can I'm putting them out myself you know I'm doing them on some really nice knobs and I'm going through actually my favorites that ain't already you know hair popping sharp they're getting the edge of sin treatment and slowly but surely they are coming along Mm. Yeah, just look at that edge, y'all. Ain't that just sexy? That's downright sexy. Now, thank y'all for watching. I appreciate y'all, you know. Thank you very much. All y'all rock, man. Uh, hope this has been uh, entertaining maybe a little bit educational for those of y'all who uh, have been asking and wondering now you know what the edge of sin really is and you know the degrees involved and in, you know everything else like that um, it's just a very nice nice edge to have you know and just uh, you can't go wrong with it y'all really can't you know once again no thank y'all all right man keep y'all keep y'all's fingers in the troll you know thank you very much for watching have a nice day y'all bye